which it does in here, Team Grenade, and we're at the Body Power 2013 in Birmingham. So far, it's absolutely amazing. We're on day three currently. Yesterday was absolutely crazy around the stand. We had so much going on. One of the best things I love about doing the Birmingham show is the fact that I get to meet all the people that follow me on the Facebook and the Twitters and stuff. So they get to come up to me and ask me about my training, ask me about my nutrition, what sort of things I've been doing, anything new that I've been trying to get involved in, and where I'm basically progressing on to. So, um, like I said, with September coming up, we've got the UK BFF um, Birmingham Nationals. Um, I'm going to be taking part in the men's physique category for my first year, so very excited about that. I've got a uh, team grenade, Jamie Alderson, being my prep coach for me, so uh, I'm in good hands. Hopefully coming in looking pretty full, really conditioned, and uh, hopefully start my uh, career as competing in the men's physique category. Training-wise at the moment, I do uh, two days on, one active rest day and then another two days on and two days off. But I tie it all in, I try and keep every, all, all my routines quite varied and like slightly different. If something works, I stick with it and then when I feel like I'm stagnating or something's not responding properly, then I'll just progress on and try something different, either whether I'm changing the rep sets or even just introducing a different exercise that I'm not familiar with. Diet-wise, you know, it's very consistent. I mean, you know, I'm going to around about 2,800 calories at the moment, just in the lead up to the show. My maintenance levels are just around 3,000 calories and then when I'm trying to put some good weight on, I'm upping it to around about 4,000 calories a day. Just making sure that the macronutrient balance is pretty right, it's pretty much spot on for my physique. And just making sure it stays consistent throughout every meal, you know, five to six solid meals a day, taking in two to three whey protein shakes, you know, just again, making sure the macros balance out a little bit and just keeping it consistent. Supplementation wise, it's, it's kind of a must for me personally because I feel like it covers all the areas. I mean, obviously you get a lot of the nutrition from your food and a lot of the essentials from your food, but there's just some things that supplements just help you get that extra edge with and just basically fill out the whole training part and, the, and make sure all your nutrition side of things comes together. My very first competition I'm going to be doing is in September. Um, I'm going to get the membership sorted and I'm making myself accountable so everyone knows that I'm doing it. And I'm supposed to get on stage, look at the best I can do. Like I mentioned, I've got Team Grenade, um, Jamie Orton, looking after me as my prep coach. So I'm in good hands and uh, I'm very, very excited. Can't wait to step on stage. I'm just going to enjoy the moment. Right, guys, so that's four months ago. We're here at the Mr. Olympia Expo in Las Vegas. Since the last four months, I actually went and competed in my first competition in the men's physique tall category. I managed to pull out a first place win, beating 13 guys. Being on that stage and then being told I was the winner, I was absolutely blown away. I was, my head was up in the clouds, I couldn't really understand what was quite going on because it was just so blurry as soon as I heard my name it and being called as the winner. My whole family and friends, everyone in the crowd was going absolutely crazy for me. It was just a surreal moment and it is a real great honour to be the winner of the UK BFF Men's Physique Tour category. So like I said, we're here at Las Vegas in the Olympia Expo. I'm helping man the booth, you know, getting all the products out there, making sure everyone knows who Grenade is and what Grenade does and how it works. I'm just really enjoying the moment. It's a beautiful city, a beautiful place, and you can't want to be anywhere else. In the next three weeks, we've got the British Finals, the 19th of October. Um, I'm going to be getting ready for that now. So I said, I've got three weeks to go. I'm here in Las Vegas, trying my hardest to keep my diet as crispy clean as I can. It's a lot of hard temptation around here with the quality of food and the you know amazing things that you can get. Um, but like I said, I'm going to stay focused, stay focused on trying to get a first place win in the British Finals. Um, I've got a one week maintenance when I get back just to try and balance myself out, correct any errors I might have uh, picked up along the way uh, out here in Las Vegas. Like I said, I'm going to do my final prep week and hopefully bring a nice fuller, drier, crisper package to the stage. here at the British Finals in Harrogate. Um, like I said, it's getting really busy at the moment. I'm getting a little bit anxious. I just want to get on stage, get it, get the ball rolling. Um, I'm very excited. I feel like I've done everything I can do at this moment. I mean, I've got Jamie Alton as my prep coach, so I know I've been in great hands all the way. I know I've made big changes and big improvements in the last four weeks, just getting to the finals today. So I'm really happy with the package I'm bringing to the stage. And uh, yeah, it's just time to enjoy it now.
Being the youngest member of Team Grenade, there's always been a little bit of a shadow over my head. Um, I've always realised that everyone has already won shows and they've already competed and they're all known for something, they've got their story behind them. Um, I've never really had that story and uh, I've always been trying to find my feet and find which path you know, to take and I've known for the last couple of years now that men's physique was the category I was always meant to do. Um, you know, it fits my personality, it fits my structure, it fits everything that I'm about. Um, so, you know, so finally being able to come here now with the title behind me as the uh, Midlands Champion champion of men's physique and uh, you know to come to my first British finals you know, I'm very happy I'm very ecstatic and uh, yeah I can't ask for anything more.